car, get out of that vehicle. On today's episode of Moto Cheese. We're good up here. Come on, we're this bottle. What's up, mini truck? Heading over to Jeff Rose. Hope everybody's staying safe with this virus. All right, everybody's out today. <laughs> I could not concentrate on what this old man was saying. <laughs> ah. She mad? Yeah, she mad. So who's the asshole here? Me or her? is loud. I mean I put a cone filter on it for the carburetor. Took the air box off just to try. It seems like it's the best so far. Now the only noise I hear is the uh, carburetor sucking air through the filter. Watch. Hey, it's like a four barrel baby. But the tires are not too bad, a lot quieter. My maxi truck, she's not a mini truck anymore, she's a maxi truck. I had a couple people tell me to put a better exhaust because these are very restrictive. Even Jeffro said that and I believe it, so I'll probably come up with something for the exhaust. Honestly, I don't want anything too loud. Wow. Uh, 5100 RPMs is 54 to 55 miles an hour. It's like four off. That's 55. 56. That's not bad. It's pretty quiet. What do you think? I need NOS. You'll blow yourself to pieces. She hums right along with these tires. I like them so far. They sent my replacement tire. That was like six and a half ounces off. I put the new one on. It was perfect. One and a half ounces balanced perfect. Definitely a good seller. They back up their product. So now I got a free shipping label to return that one. I got to return it. Jeff Rose Cobb Shop. Let's see what he's cobbing up in his cob shop. He told me that people don't know what cobbing is. You guys know what cobbing is, right? When you cob something up, us rednecks, we know what it is. Oh, slow down, Minnie. It's like you're excited to see Tiny Tonka or something. Uh, get out of that vehicle. <laughs> What's going on at Jeff Rose Cobb Shop today? I'm looking up a GoPro. Wow, nice. I don't know if it's going to work or not. Do you think it could be all right there? Yeah, that's a good spot. So where are we going, Jeffro? I think it's a mine shaft over in uh, next this place called Gooseboro. Bantam. All right. Let's check it out. Let's go, Tiny Tonka. Right, let's do it. Size of them horns again. Holy cow. Those things are going to 
be loud. Hammer down. Made all three. Oh, well, I can hear yours. That's the difference between the horns, I guess. Hey, there's an old 170 Kubota, kind of like mine. Who's going to say that? Mine's a 180. We'll have to do the minus size touch shut to it first. Definitely. Right up on your tail. You feel like you're so much closer, but look how much room there actually is. Yeah. Granis Pond. You hang tight, Minnie. We will be right back. <laughs> Jesus, that's loud. <laughs> I had my remote upside down. I meant to hit the regular horn. <laughs> she's, she's scared. <laughs> Tiny, Tiny won't take care of you. Take care of her, Tiny. <laughs> I guess I can see how far this goes, too, huh? <laughs> Stop talking back. Boy, this got a long range, huh? I guess so. Holy cow. Look how far. I mean, that's pretty far. How's it going? Oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah, never knew that was here. This is the part I wanted before. I'm seeing it further. Oh, I got boards and everything down. Jeez. That's not bad though. Holy cow. I don't know if I can see any better with this one. No. Huh. huh. You might have to chase the iron. You look at the iron. Yeah, I see. Well, oh, that's glass. Never mind. <laughs> I thought I saw some silicate. Huh. Oh, well, yeah, see the tools they use there. Yeah. There's some marks still. You think it was iron? It must have been a iron shell full of iron right here. It takes this iron sheet. Was that from the Indians? Hey. Yeah. <laughs> hey, man. Uh huh. Oh, if I do wide, it, don't, uh, it comes in. It just doesn't have enough as much light. Yeah, triple water. Oh, yeah. Damn. Focus, 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 focus. Jesus. Is that the new one? Yeah. Sometimes it takes a while to focus. There's supposed to be an update. What's that, the 20? Yeah, S20. No shit. The zoom is unbelievable on this thing. I mean... This is cool though. It comes back in here quite a ways. Yeah, I went to there before because couldn't see. I, I'm going to try a night shot when we go out a little bit. Turn around and see if I can get that. We'll see how good it is. Oh, right here. Let's see. Entrance is there. So, I'm going to. Those photos didn't come out too bad. Night shot didn't because there's no light to capture. Of course. A little bit of water, huh? Yeah. Where people get through their pallets. Don't fall in. I, I mean, it'd make a good video, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's not worth it. No. Now I'll be the one that falls in. You just put the wood, you put it in the Right. Oh, yeah.
Is that yours? No. Yeah, I wanted to see if it reached. Yeah, we're out getting the fresh air from the fresh air. We're That's good up here. <laughs> Have a good day. Oh yeah. Some beaver dam we were. That's a big freaking hut they got. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. That's that. <laughs> so they said there's holes up there but no caves. This is how everybody quarantines in a country. Yeah. That's not that deep. It might it might go in on an angle though. There's a hole there and it goes kind of that way. Two of those makes a spot of one. That's new. All right, there's a pond. Oh, there's how the trail goes around a pond. You see it? Yeah. <laughs> you can lead the way. We got a tractor on the road. Could be your mic too, because it sounds like it's breaking up a little bit. But before it was scratchy, now it's just on and off. Oh no! Yeah, it didn't cut out that time. Getting your picture taken. Picture taken, guys. Wow. Mini and Tiny Tonka are pretty popular. It's been like that everywhere I go. Maybe we should have made up some little masks for the front of these trucks and, you know, virus patrol or something. For this thing with the, with the off it, you know? The very, very beginning broke up and then I got the last half. Let's go this way. That lake's got an island. Pretty nice forest here. Well, not a lot of quarantine people around here, huh? Oh, there's a foundation right there. Oh, wow, look at that. Looks like metal detecting time. I've said it before, we're mini truck drivers. It's okay. Where's my probe? There it is. There's gotta be a lot of metal around here or something. Oh, top of a liquor bottle. Oh, You're the best assistant trailer park supervisor anybody ever had. I got a feeling there's going to be a lot of that around here. <laughs> What'd you get? That's a big thing. I found a hinge. You see it?
Jeez, another hinge. There. Yeah, I see that. Propane. I guess we'll take some of the garbage out. Bottle. As long as it ain't a piss bottle. Joe's piss jug! Bubbles, it's the way of the road. Fucking way of the road. Ooh, it's tripping on me. We probably knew what we're doing. Sort this shit. <laughs> we probably yeah, we might find something if we knew what we're doing. <laughs> I guess we're not retiring today. We nope. didn't we didn't hit the big one today. Nope. Don't leave it out me, Jeffro. A little fire pit right there. Fill up before the apocalypse, Minnie. Beep. How's it going? It's looking for some snacks, of course. Got to get enough for the wife. Might be in it for the long haul. After they make the call, right? Yeah, right. Stay safe. You too, man. We got a bunch of snacks. Mm -hmm. Had to buy a damn bag. Because we bought so many snacks. Back home, Minnie. Everybody that watching, stay safe.